Welcome back. What a wonderful day outside. I got, hope you had a chance to get outside and enjoy it. Maybe you're doing a barbecue right now. That would be a great idea. We've got lots of blue skies, 57 degrees right now in downtown. But our weather headlines, the big one. It's going to be a cold night tonight. Tomorrow's going to be really nice. And then the clouds are going to make their way back into the area. But let's talk about those cold temperatures. You can see our lows are going to be below freezing for some of us. Coeur d'Alene, 28 degrees. Moses Lake, 31 degrees. And this is going to be the area that we're really going to watch here. This Moses this lake area, Green Cooley. You can see Ritzville 29 degrees. In fact, in the Tri Cities, we have a freeze warning. So take a look at this freeze warning. All of the blue. All the counties in the blue have that freeze warning simply because the growing season has already started and we're going to be below freezing for a lot of that those areas. So if you live there, you have friends that live there, here's how you can protect your plants. First thing, if they are potted plants, make sure you bring them inside. But if they're not, they're out in the garden, maybe you have some tulips growing, water them before dark. So go out there and water them right now. And then you can cover them before dark too. So you can keep that heat inside. You can cover them with a sheet, with a freeze sheet. You you can also grab a paper cup and put it upside down just to keep all of that heat inside. But tomorrow it's really going to warm up quickly. We're going to be cold in the morning, but then 63 degrees is your high temperature in Spokane. You're looking at 70 in Moses Lake and it really will warm up in the Tri Cities there. 71 degrees, but our future cast. This is part of the reason it's going to be so cold because we don't have any clouds in the area. The clouds keep that warmth and they really act as a blanket, but then watch as things kind of change a little bit. So Monday's going to be very similar to today and then we've got snow across the cascades. We're going to see some snow and some rain into the Spokane area. You can see a lot of activity here Tuesday at 5 p.m. We're going to get snow into the northern Idaho panhandle, rain into Idaho and into Montana. We're going to see some rain in Spokane as well. We have a chance for it. So Tuesday, this is when everything changes. Tuesday, uh, we have a 20% chance for some rain, 56 degrees. Then on Wednesday, 55 degrees, you can see a 20% chance for rain really all week. And then Friday, Saturday, we've got a 30% chance of rain, but our highs are going to stay right there in the 60s.